Hi guys, welcome to Elsie's YouTube page. Um, I'm here to show you guys a demonstration on one of the looks that I favor the most. So today we're going to prime her face with, nonetheless, Elsie. Um, we're going to go ahead and moisturize first. And then we go in with the primer. So now that we're going to let that all soak into the skin, we're going to start off by priming her eyes with MAC Soft Ochre. Okay, once you have that all over the lid, you want to go in with the LC Cosmetics Minimalist Palette. I'm going to go ahead and grab some of that. Put this over the brow it's bone. Time. And then we want to go in with Tone Up. I'm going in with the same brush. This is um, R37. You want to go in with Warmth. Love this color. We're going to focus this more on her crease. We're not going to take it up as high. You want to go back in with the um, tone up and just kind of go back into the crease, bring that color back a little bit, make sure it's all blended. So once that's all done, you want to go in with a dense blending brush. This is from Luxie. One to one mini tapered brush. This, we're going to pick up the brown, which is in depth and kind of emphasize her lash line. You want to keep it more so on the outer corner of her lash line, um, only to give it that smoky effect. I'm going in with the black, which should be smoke, smoke out. out. I need that one. Smoke out. You want to kind of line the lower lash, I mean the her lash line, just so when you place the eyelashes, it's not just sitting on, it's like the orange isn't peeking through her lashes. It's going to look a little bit odd. I'm going to go in with these two shades. She does look like um, a sand. However, she's a little bit lighter too, so I'm going to go in with my sand and my vanilla. I'm going to go in with probably the best concealers at the moment. Everybody talks about this, so this is the Tarte Shape Tape. Tarte. And then I start off with um, light medium just to kind of conceal underneath her eyes. Look up.
Now we're gonna go in and conceal. Um, we're gonna do light underneath her eyes just to kind of brighten up a little bit. I'm gonna go in with Soleil Tan de Chanel. So I use it more on my light skin um, clientele. I go in with my Bedellium Tools brush, 942. I'm gonna just bronze up her cheeks a little bit. We're going in with LC, the bronzer. We're going to start off with lights to kind of bronze her up a little bit and then go in depth with 10. So after this, I just want to go in and I'm going to set underneath her eyes. I'm going to go in with Sorry, these are super dirty. Cover FX. This really keeps you matte. If you're oily, this is going to be your best friend. But if you are dry, you really want to stay away from this. Luxie brush, 5 to 2. I'm going to go in with 10. I'm not going to get too much. I'm gonna go in with more of a golden tone. Um, I think it looks good on her skin. I've done her makeup before, so I know it looks good. <laughs> so this is gonna be the cover effects in sunlight. We're gonna highlight. I'm gonna go in with Dose of Colors Gold is a New Black. This is a very beautiful golden shade with my Morphe B8 fan brush. I am gonna use Tam Nova in Minx. There's so many different ways you could do underneath her eyes just to kind of get, keep it soft. You can go in with the brown just to kind of give it that more sultry look. Another favorite part, uh, we're going to go in and do the mascara, uh, the eyelashes. Going in with my Lorac Pro Mascara. She already has long lashes. Um, I'm going to go in with Elegant Lashes in RW, RDW Thick. 
the black ones. These are amazing. I'm going to customize her lashes and make them um, wispy. So we are going to go in and I do like to um, put eyeliner over the lash line just so it doesn't show too much when I put it over her eyes. So I'm just going to grab a little bit of Inglot. Just make sure that you just look one direction and make sure the glue dries before you do anything else. Let me see. I just want to see if this is dry. So it's pretty dry. I'm going to go in with um, my Flare Long individual lashes. I use these a lot. I'm just going to emphasize the corner of her lashes with more long ones. And then I'm going to go in with the medium ones and sneak a couple of individuals in there. So while the eyelashes are going to dry, we're going to go ahead and go in with the lip color. I like to do in more of a nude color only because um, you have a lot going on in the eyes. So you want to kind of keep it subtle and go in with nude. This is my, um, I use this on everybody. This is the MAC Strip Down. I use this literally for every, every client. It works great. Another one of my favorite combinations, Dose of Colors, uh, Sand and Truffle. I mix them together. Depending on if she wants it more nude, I would do more of a nude. If she wants more pink, I would do more of a pink, but I'm going to just kind of balance it out with the two. So this is the final look. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and tune in to next week for more artists and more looks.